greetings to all figure skating fans. In the coming minutes on the main events of the day, the disciplinary committee of the Russian anti-doping agency has acquitted figure skater Kamila Valieva, the TASS news agency reported, citing the press service of the world anti-doping agency WADA. The world anti-doping agency has been informed by the Russian anti-doping agency that its disciplinary committee has ruled in the case of figure skater Kamila Valieva. The committee concluded that although the athlete had committed an anti-doping rule violation, she was not guilty of it. Therefore, the committee imposed no sanctions other than cancellation of her results as of the date of sample collection, 25 December 2021, reads the press release. Let me remind you that Valiva became the Russian champion on December 25, 2021. Alexandra Trusova was second, Anna Shcherbakova came in third. Thus, the gold medal must go to Alexandra Trusova. It is also reported that WADA will appeal to the Court of Arbitration for Sport, against the findings of the Russian Anti-Doping Agency, that Valieva is not guilty of violating anti-doping rules. WADA is concerned about the finding of no fault or negligence, and will not hesitate to exercise its right to appeal to the Court of Arbitration for Sport in due course, the statement said. Before I continue to update you, please take a few seconds of your time and subscribe to the channel and like this video, thank you very much. Veronika Lodjanova, Director General of the Russian Anti-Doping Agency, has spoken out on the situation surrounding the doping case of figure skater Kamila Valieva. Earlier, Rusada's disciplinary committee found Valieva not guilty of an anti-doping rule violation, but invalidated her results from the Russian Championships in St. Petersburg on 25 December, the day she tested positive. The Russian Anti-Doping Agency has not yet received the full text of the decision of the disciplinary anti-doping committee, namely its reasoning. We will conduct a legal evaluation of the reasons for the committee's decision. The Russian Anti-Doping Agency will consider the possibility of appealing the decision of the disciplinary committee. We expect to receive the full text of the decision as soon as possible and without any delays, said Lojanova. I should note that the disciplinary committee is an independent body. Figure skater Alexandra Trusova will be declared the winner of the Russian Championship held in December 2021. Kamila Valieva's results of December 25, 2021, are to be annulled, and on that day Valieva became the Russian champion. Thus, the second place after Trusova will be taken by Anish Chubakova, and the third by Adelia Petrosyan. Kamila Valieva has removed the mention of the Russian champion title from her social media profile descriptions. The victory of the tournament was marked on Valieva's two social media profiles as a gold medal, now they are missing. Sports lawyer Anna Antsilaevich spoke out about the allocation of medals following the 2022 Russian Championships. After the decision of the disciplinary anti-doping committee, Trusova automatically becomes the winner of the pre-Olympic Championship of Russia. And she will be at least until the end of all appeal procedures, if appeals against the decision of the disciplinary committee come to the Court of Arbitration for Sport from WADA, ISU or the Russian Anti-Doping Agency. The decision of the Disciplinary Anti-Doping Committee can only be appealed to the Court of Arbitration for Sport, as Valiva is an international athlete. The period for filing an appeal is 21 days after all the parties have received the reasoning decision, said Antsilaevich. Olympic champion Svetlana Jarova spoke out about the doping case of Russian figure skater Kamila Valieva. These are interim decisions, everyone understands that, and most likely, in the end everything will be decided in court. But if only foreign lawyers could defend us and it led to good results, now it will be more difficult many of them are forbidden to do so. On the other hand, it is important that the disciplinary committee took this particular decision. The position is clear and formulated on an evidentiary basis. Next, most likely, it will be considered by WADA, and we understand that they will try to win this situation back in their own way, Jarova said. Three-time Olympic figure skating champion Arena Ranina commented on the decision of the Rusada disciplinary committee to acquit Camila Valiva. Valieva's acquittal is positive news, but we need to wait for further action and the decision of the Court of Arbitration for Sport. There is hope that our guys will be given gold medals in the team event. We should not forget that it was the Court of Arbitration for Sport that allowed Valieva to skate at the Beijing Olympics. As for the investigation by the Russian Anti-Doping Agency, it was conducted behind closed doors, so it's not surprising that we don't know the details, Rudnina said. Thank you for watching this video till the end. Subscribe to the channel, do not forget to like it and give your opinion in comments. See you soon.